Hi, Winnipeg. I'm Rebecca, and uh, I'm in my mid to late 2030s. So I'm at this weird age where like all of my friends have children, but I don't, um, which is like a really lonely but well-rested place to be in your life. Who here has kids? Round of applause. Okay, who here does not have children? Okay. I think it's pretty clear that the second group has way more energy than the first group. But yeah, it, it's kind of sad. When I find out somebody's pregnant, I'm always very happy for them, you know? But there's another piece of me that's like, oh, I've lost a friend, right? Not because you like disappear or disintegrate when you have a baby, um, but the dynamic of the friendship changes. And it's nobody's fault, it's just life, right? But I think largely it's because if you have a baby, your level of important is very different from my level of important, right? Because you have a life to keep like a lifing. <laughs> and I don't have that, you know? Like I was recently talking to my friend, she's one of my best friends, she lives in Montreal. We hadn't talked in a long time. She has a four-year-old daughter. We get on the phone, I was like, how are you? She was like, well actually we had a really tough week. Um, on Thursday, Ella got a fever. And we gave her Tylenol and stuff, but it was just going up, it wasn't going down. Um, so then on Friday, we took her to the walk-in and they took one look at her and they were like, you have to take this kid to the emergency room. So we go to the hospital and then they start doing like tests and they're like, we don't know. We don't know what to tell you, right? And then it's like 24 hours and they're like more tests, more tests. We don't know what to tell you. We don't know. It's like, this is my baby. What do you mean you don't know what to tell me? And finally they figured it out. It was like a kidney infection. She's on antibiotics now. She's fine. <laughs> anyway, God, I'm so boring. How are you? <laughs> I can't compete with that. <laughs> How am I? <laughs> but I try, like I try to identify, you know? I was like, um, yeah, um, I hear you, that's hard. Um, yeah, things are uh, with me. Uh, yeah, actually, uh, my hair dryer broke. <laughs> um, I was like late for a meeting. <laughs> and then I had to go to Shoppers Drug Mart, right? And I don't know if you've bought a hair dryer recently, but there's like 20 different kinds. <laughs> I was there for like half an hour. My bangs were all screwed up. <laughs> and then I went to pay and um, I couldn't find my optimum car because it had like fallen into the bottom of my purse and I didn't know. And it was like a 20 times the points day, so I missed out on like 70,000 points. <laughs> oh God, um, could we talk later? I'm kind of drunk right now. Um, <laughs> So yeah, I was recently invited to this brunch and, um, and everyone there was married except for me and everyone there has kids except for me and this one other couple, okay? And then this couple asks that couple, are you guys planning to have kids? And then this is how they answered. Um, she turned to her husband. She said, well, <sighs> we're trying, <laughs> okay? Um, <laughs> Here's the thing, because basically what that phrase means, we're trying, is like, we're having a lot of sex right now, <laughs> okay? <laughs> and I think, I think it's largely because I don't like that woman. I think you can tell I find her very irritating, right? Um, I think if it was somebody I liked, and somebody said, are you guys planning to have kids? And she was like, well, we're having a lot of sex right now, so maybe, <laughs> high five! Like, <laughs> I'd be like, yeah, kids are cool, do it, right? But instead she's like, we're trying. So then that's the kind of sex that I picture. I don't picture like good sex. I picture them like, uh, like, like the kind of sex you would purchase in like a picture frame, you know? Like it's like sweet and saccharine and they're like self-congratulatory. They're like, oh honey, oh, mm, I love you so much. Oh, we're trying, yeah. Thank you so much, Winnipeg.